Can Jude Bellingham fulfill his potential to become the best midfielder on the planet and compete for the Ballon d'Or? The 19-year-old's meteoric rise continued as he claimed the prestigious Copa Trophy in 2023. Welcome back to Pitch Talk, let's get started. Jude Bellingham's star continues to rise. The 19-year-old midfielder was awarded the prestigious Copa Trophy at the 2023 Ballon d'Or ceremony, recognizing him as the best performing player under 21 years old. It caps off a tremendous year for Bellingham, who has established himself as one of the top talents in world football. After developing in the youth system at Birmingham City, Bellingham made his senior debut for the club at just 16 years old in 2019. His mature performances in central midfield led to Borussia Dortmund signing him the following year for a fee of around 25 million euro. The move to the Bundesliga provided a platform for Bellingham to showcase his skills against top European opposition. Under the guidance of coaches Lucien Favre and Eden Terzic, Bellingham quickly adapted to the demands of German football. He brings a combination of technical quality, physical power, and tactical intelligence well beyond his years. Bellingham played a key role in Dortmund's triumph in the 2020-21 season and was integral to their run to the Champions League quarterfinals. His partnership with midfielders like Axel Witzel and Mahmoud Dahoud provided balance in the engine room. Bellingham contributed four goals and eight assists in all competitions that season. The 2021-22 campaign saw Bellingham take his performances up another level. Terzic replacing Favre brought more attacking license to Bellingham's game. He scored six goals in the Bundesliga, finding the back of the net against Bayern Munich and RB Leipzig amongst others. His lung-bursting runs from midfield added dynamism to Dortmund's play. On the European stage, Bellingham excelled against elite opponents. He netted in both legs as Dortmund knocked out Sevilla in the Champions League round of 16. The teenager outshone seasoned internationals like Ivan Rakitic and Lucas Ocampos. Dortmund's European run ended in defeat to Manchester City in the quarterfinals, but Bellingham left a lasting impression. Bellingham earned praise from City manager Pep Guardiola, who described him as the whole package and tipped the youngster as a future Ballon d'Or candidate. High praise indeed from one of the sport's sharpest minds. The maturity Bellingham displays goes well beyond his technical and physical strengths. He shows leadership in abundance, evidenced by him captaining Dortmund on several occasions. For someone so early in their career, Bellingham communicates with the wisdom of someone far older. Bellingham is equally influential for the English national team. After progressing through the youth ranks, he made his senior debut in 2020 aged just 17. England manager Gareth Southgate immediately saw Bellingham's qualities and made him a key figure in central midfield. At the 2022 World Cup in Qatar, Bellingham shone on the global stage. He assisted goals against Iran and Senegal in the group stage as England comfortably reached the knockout rounds. The last 16 saw Bellingham deliver a man of the match display against Senegal, where he set up Jordan Henderson's opener and dominated proceedings from box to box. England's World Cup hopes ended in the quarterfinals after defeat on penalties to France but Bellingham emerged from the tournament with his reputation enhanced, recognized as one of Europe's elite young talents. For someone who does not turn 20 until May 2023, Bellingham has achieved an incredible amount already. After signing a contract extension to 2025 with Dortmund in 2021, speculation mounted over Bellingham's future. Europe's super clubs all craved his signature, attracted by his enormous potential. Real Madrid, Liverpool, and Manchester City were among those linked with blockbuster bids. But it was Real Madrid who secured Bellingham's services in July 2023, signing him for an initial fee of 100 million euro. It is a Spanish record fee for a teenager, beating the 80 million euro Madrid paid for Vinicius Jr. in 2018. But such an outlay underlines how highly Los Blanco rate Bellingham. The expectations are sky-high, but Bellingham has settled superbly into life at the Bernabeu. He scored on his home debut in La Liga against Real Betis, coolly converting a penalty in a 2-1 win. Bellingham followed that up with goals against Barcelona, Atletico Madrid, and Sevilla before the end of August. Playing alongside Luka Modric, Toni Kroos, and Aurelien Choameni, Bellingham adds energy and goal threat. His late runs into the box have become a signature, and he has struck up an immediate understanding with Karim Benzema. 
five goals in his first six La Liga matches only scratched the surface of Bellingham's influence. He covered more ground than any other Madridista during that period, providing steel and creativity in equal measure. The young Englishman has slotted seamlessly into Carlo Ancelotti's team. October saw Bellingham produce his most eye-catching display yet for Los Blancos, running the show in a crucial home match against fierce rivals Barcelona. Up against the likes of Sergio Busquets and Pedri, Bellingham rose to the occasion. With Madrid trailing 1-0 and under pressure before halftime, Bellingham picked up the ball 30 yards from goal. He powered through Barca's midfield before firing an unstoppable drive into the top corner, bringing the Bernabeu crowd to their feet. Bellingham's equalizer shifted the momentum in Madrid's favor. He continued to boss the center of the pitch, winning back possession and launching attacks. As the game entered stoppage time, Bellingham arrived late in the box to turn home the winner. Cue wild celebrations with his teammates as the stadium erupted. His man-of-the-match display in El Clasico drew widespread acclaim. Bellingham outshone Barca's pedigreed midfielders and demonstrated leadership beyond his years. He is now a bona fide Galactico in the eyes of the Madrid fans. Former England defender Rio Ferdinand summed up the reaction, claiming Bellingham has the footballing world at his feet after taking El Clasico by the scruff of its neck aged just 19. High praise from a Premier League legend. Bellingham maintains close links with England, returning to represent the three Lions during international breaks. National team manager Gareth Southgate cannot speak highly enough of Bellingham's leadership credentials. He labeled the teenager as England's future captain, after more mature displays against Italy and Germany. If Bellingham maintains his skyward trajectory, anything is possible. The Ballon d'Or award for the world's best player is always a forward's preserve, with Luka Modric the only midfielder to win it since 2007. But Bellingham possesses the all-round qualities to contend for that individual honor. Continuing to thrive for Real Madrid is Bellingham's first priority. If he can inspire Los Blancos to trophy success on multiple fronts, his case will strengthen. Madrid's conquest of Europe is tradition, and Bellingham now has a central role to play. At just 19, Bellingham has his best years well ahead of him. The milestones and accolades racked up already are frightening given his age. Each day brings improvement working alongside Madrid's squad of seasoned winners. Former Dortmund teammate Erling Haaland claimed Bellingham can become one of the best midfielders ever during their time together in the Bundesliga. Bold praise, but not unrealistic for a player of his enormous potential. The Copa Trophy will likely prove just one stepping stone in Bellingham's career. Now starring for Real Madrid, the biggest club stage in the sport, he is determined to establish himself as the world's premier midfielder over the next decade. At club level, multiple Champions League titles could await for Bellingham at Real Madrid as Los Blancos chase another era of European dominance. On the international scene, taking England to World Cup or Euros glory would put the cherry on top for the teenager. After winning the Copa Trophy, what could be next for Jude Bellingham as he continues his seemingly unstoppable rise to the top? Will we see him compete for the Ballon d'Or and Champions League titles with Real Madrid and lead England to World Cup glory over the next decade? Let me know in the comments section. And don't forget to like, subscribe to Pitch Talk, stay up to date on all the latest football news. We'll see you next time.